S stands for service, O stands for ownership, A stands for achievement, and R stands for resilience. It is 100% about our students and us helping them expand their world and become a little bit future ready, connecting with our community, and um, they're just really excited. Mark T. Voss Middle School principal, Dr. Betho Hinojosa, says SOAR Day is all about giving students choice in their school day. Our kids are getting um, to choose what they want to do, to choose what they want to explore, uh, things that we may not have time during the school day. So there's different stations and you get to choose your activity. Stations throughout the school on SOAR Day include marketing professionals teaching students how to brand and sell their own line of hats, hiking 101 with Dr. Hinojosa, a Q&A with the campus SRO, ways to manage stress with the campus counselors, and even stations with professional athletes. Everyone has goals to achieve something, whether it's in sports or it has something that's like you need academics. Academics are important. It has to be a doctor, engineer, whatever it is. And so by also practicing good habits of making sure you're there and you're on time and you're ready to go. I mean, creating those habits, I mean, you're setting yourself up for the future too. Ty Summers with the Green Bay Packers says he was happy to help, especially since there's another positive outcome from these SOAR days. If you miss a day, let's say miss Friday, you're missing a whole chunk of, of knowledge that you could have potentially learned that could then impact your quizzes, tests, whatever it is assignment-wise you have coming up. So it's important to make sure you're there every day. SOAR days used to be held on Wednesdays, but are now held on Fridays as an added incentive to get students in attendance. And this is just a way to get kids here. Um, our kids, normally they want to be at school, but sometimes maybe on Fridays, um, we want them just to tell their parents, hey, I don't want to miss on Friday. Let's hold off until four o'clock to take our trip because I want to go to SOAR day. Parker Ballinger says he and his friends make sure not to miss. The person who missed, like, they're missing out, I guess, yeah. And so, like, we tell them all about it. Parker's watching his friends perform in Romeo and Juliet. He also attended the station with Bernie's YMCA. Thank you to all of our community who just gives up their time to come uh, with us and be with us and just uh, engage with our school. Your showcase of innovation for February, SOAR Day.